Welcome everybody to the Single and Stiletto Show. I'm Suzanne Oshima and I'm a matchmaker and dating coach at Dream Bachelor and Bachelorette. And I'm also the founder of Single and Stilettos. Today we have on our show Jackie Sabrin and she's a love and dating coach at Engaged at Any Age. And today we're talking about the secrets to attraction. But before we jump into it, Jackie, I would love for you to tell our audience a little bit about you and how you became a love and dating coach. First of all, thank you, Suzanne, for having me on the show. I really am enjoying these little interviews. And um, the way I became a love and dating coach is by my own struggle, by my own journey. I was inspired through pushing through um, the mistakes and the problems I had in finding love in that journey. And I know that a lot of you experience a breakdown in your relationships or loss of love. And so I just um, started to notice a pattern of my own that was happening. And I started to get to work on me and clearing up a lot of those things. And as I did, I became, uh, I started to become the ideal man list that I had. And that's when I manifested my husband. And I met him on Match. And so it is possible, it does happen. We've been married for a year and a half. So I'm just really inspired to help women who want to find love in their life, to inspire them to know that they, it can happen. You just, there is a little bit of a strategy that we're going to share with you. And if you just stick to the strategy, it can happen for you. That is very, very true, ladies. It doesn't matter. Like, the name of your company is Engaged at Any Age. You can get engaged at any age. So that is very true. Um, and Jackie and I are both living proof of that. So um, let's talk about the secrets to attraction. So tell me your first tip on the secrets to attraction. So, you know, it's not really much of a secret, but I think women don't realize how much power eye contact and smiling has. Men are waiting for us to give them the signal, to give them the, the signal that we're approachable. And we get so nervous or stuck in our own thoughts when we're not conscious is we forgot, we forget to just simply smile and hold eye contact. So that's a very attractive quality is when a man sees a woman and she's looking at him and she smiles and she holds a smile. And that is like an instant zip for him. He's going to get a quick connection with you. And, and it's a very intimate, it's a lot of intimacy in holding eye contact with a man if you've ever tried it so it's a simple tool but I think we forget to use it and how much power it really it yields over a man that is so true and I know every woman out there has heard this eye contact and smiling but I can't tell you how many men tell me that a lot of women don't make eye contact or they don't smile and they need that green light in order to feel like it's okay to approach you so yeah. And I think that what you have to do is practice. Everything in life is practice. And I recommend, and I actually did this, is going to a place where there's a lot of men with simply the intention to practice making eye contact and smiling. So it could be a grocery store or it could be a Whole Foods, someplace where maybe not even in your neighborhood if you want, don't want to be, if you want to step out of your comfort zone and go somewhere else. But um, just go in there with the intention to smile at men and give them that like flirty smile and see what happens. I mean, you might get really triggered and, and your blood might boil a little bit you might your face might turn red but once you get back out to your car you're going to go like wow every man in the store is looking at you and it really does work so how many men approached you when you practice that you know I actually smile a lot because I trained myself to do it. I uh -huh. decided that I needed to start making eye contact at the bar, a part of becoming more intimate with people mm -hmm. and inviting intimacy. And so I started smiling and I do it. I, I work in a big office building. I have an office place and I see people every day, all day. So I'm always smiling and being friendly. So the other day at the gym, I just naturally smiled at this man that I hadn't seen there before. So just a few moments later, you won't believe what happened. This guy comes up to me and says, excuse me, um, my friend was just noticing you, and he wants to know if he can have your number. He'd like to call you. And I was like, wow, thank you so much. I'm really flattered. I said I'm married. and um, But, wow, it's really sweet of you to approach me and tell him I said thank you so much. And I was a little, like, taken <laughs> off guard because it really does work. It and does. It really yeah. does. And I like how you said to just practice it because I think we do, we get out of, we get so in our day-to-day -day life into tunnel vision and we just walk down the street or we go do about our routine and we don't make eye contact and just smile at people. So I think it's good to do that practice thing. I love that. Yeah, absolutely. And so the next thing I would recommend is, um, is your voice. The tone of voice, it's important. It's it's 70% your tone. So I think that sometimes when women are hurt or they're frustrated, they don't realize how they can come off sounding a little um, bossy. 
and men say that a lot. Women are bossy or they're asking, they're demanding and they don't really realize they're doing it. They're working in their day job all day and they're having to give orders and be leaders. And then they go and meet a man and they said, can you hand me that? And it just doesn't come off as so it's a tone of voice, really looking at how we just taking a breath and softening just like I'm doing now. And I'm, I realize how I'm talking fast and racing, but slowing down. And when you smile, when you talk, your tone, you have that, you can hear the smile in your talk. And so I think that's a big part of it is your tone of voice. That is true. That is very true. And especially because I live in New York where women can be so rushed and abrupt about what they say. So I like that tip. So what's your third tip? The third tip is, again, this confidence and body. Um, and these are all kind of external tips that I'm giving you. There are much deeper things that you can do, but externally, and I wanted to focus on these because they're just such quick things, is confidence in your posture. I mean, let's let's throw our shoulders back and just stand up and kind of hunker down and bring all of your energy down into your body and root your legs. Women carry their energy right beneath their um, beneath your belly button and your pelvis bone, right in there. And so you want to root your energy by just kind of sinking down into your body, being in your body, which will bring you much more presence to every encounter that you have. And so just confidence with body language, putting your shoulders back and just leaning back into things not really leaning into it but leaning back into everything and making that eye contact and smiling that says a lot right there it just says that you're confident that you care about yourself you love yourself and how you feel about yourself really matters to a man a man wants to be with a woman who who loves herself and um, if you don't that's a di direct reflection in fact by your confidence is how much you know love you have for yourself that is so true, and men have actually told me that they think a woman that's confident is so sexy. So. Absolutely, it is. So fake it until you make it. <laughs> Just practice these things until you start to see the results really quickly, and then you can step into it more and more. Exactly. Well, these have been some amazing tips. So Jackie, tell our audience about the free gift that you have for everybody. Oh, I'm really excited about this. I created a little bundle for you. So it's not just one, it's three gifts. The first one is an audio, How to Be Irresistible. It's a more in-depth discussion on really a step-by-step -step process to take you to your authentic self, which is really what magnetizes a man to you. And that's coupled with a open to love guided meditation so that you can start to visualize yourself with your man. And then I wanted to um, offer you a free 30 minute call with me so that I can help you uh, bring more awareness to any blocks that might be sabotaging you. So um, I know that you have the link right there on the page. You can just click on that and it'll take you right to that, that bundle. Exactly. So everybody who's watching the video, just click on the link below. And if you're listening to the podcast, ladies, go to singleandstilettos.com and look for Jackie's interview under the weekly shows. So thanks, everybody, for joining us on the Single on Stiletto Show. Our show is available both in video format and podcast format. If you like to view the videos, you can go to singleonstilettos.com. And if you like to get the podcast, you can go to iTunes and download it from there. And if you would like to get our free ebook on the three secrets guaranteed to attract any man based on scientific research, you can click right here on the video or you can go to singleonstilettos.com.